And we're told that this 616 unit here for the Marine Drive complex was actually built back in 1951. And there are a lot of mechanical issues with this complex. The Buffalo Municipal Housing Authority was looking at the idea of trying to modernize the complex. But now they've decided to go in a different direction. They intend to build a new complex and tear this down as part of that new complex. The more we got into the analysis, the more we realized that the buildings, the whole development is a mess. The sewer lines are falling apart. The water mains break. The heating is incredibly inefficient. It's difficult to regulate. In addition, Brown maintains the individual housing units, also without central air, and even hallways are just too small. So they just want to build new and replace all seven 10 story towers in a new complex of smaller buildings and townhouses, utilizing the adjacent visitors parking lot for a 21 acre footprint. And we'll build a big new building or buildings in the parking lot and then we will make that building or buildings big enough to accommodate two of the towers. We'll vacate those two towers, move people into brand new units, and then demolish those two towers. And then with the remaining footprint, we'll build, transfer, demolish, until all seven towers are down. Gillian Brown says they hope to start holding design meetings with the residents to give them input into the planning for a new complex. And he says that process could actually begin the end of this month. Reporting for Marine Drive here in Buffalo, I'm Ron Plants, Channel 2 News.